So like I said in the previous video, interpolate smoothens the position between the previous frame and the current frame in fixed time step and extrapolate smoothens the position between the current frame and it tries to predict the position of the object in the next frame in the fixed time step. So if I go to edit, project settings, time, you will notice that the fixed time step is set to 0.02. If I change this value to 0.3, now rigid body will update the position of the cube only after 0.3 seconds. So I'm going to hit on the play button now. You will notice that the cube is falling with a judder and it's clearly visible. This is because Unity is updating the position of this object only after 0.3 seconds. Now I will turn on interpolate. And now I'm going, going to hit on the play button. You will notice that the object is falling very smoothly right now. This is because interpolate is actually smoothening the positions between the previous frame and the current frame. Now I'm going to turn on extrapolate and hit on the play button. You will notice that the cube is still pretty smoothly falling on the ground. But in the end you will notice that the cube went in the ground a bit and then came back. This is because extrapolate was trying to predict the position of the cube into the future and it didn't know about the ground. So once the collision occurred, it put the cube back to the position where it should be.